and welcome back to the channel. Um, today we'll be playing Mr. Bullet again because I it, it's the first game that I saw. I don't really want the exact thing because that makes no sense. Now this level has been giving me a little bit of grief recently. What I think you need to do is hit both with one bullet, but how does that work? Uh, yeah, that would work, but that's the only thing I can think of that would work. So I'm just gonna have to do that. Now this one is easy. I can just go like that. Bullet Beach. What is a name like Bullet Beach? Um, oh. Okay. I was not expecting that to actually work. Because I did that accidentally. And somehow it worked. It's weird. And to do that and then crack it, it's far open in there. Shoot the bottom. That was easy. Gosh, these are so easy. Uh, I need to hit exactly in the middle. There we go. I just hit it in the gap. So I knew they would hit both. There we go. That one needs more peels up though. I'm not just doing much better than I thought I would. That's just weird. That one. Now this one will make it go at a 90 degree angle so I can do that quite easily. Ooh. Nope. Ah, I think I know. Like, yep, like that. Sure. That's not what I meant to do but it works. This will hit that coming up there, which will then hit the TNT and then TNT is actually um another name for trinitrotolin. Try saying that five times faster. It's a mouthful just to say at normal speed. Never mind it five times speed. No, that does nothing. I just need to hit you like that, but then it's just a pure luck scenario. Yeah, it's more of a pure luck scenario, that one is. If it will actually kill. Oh, you should go for legs. Because, of course, they then will jerk forward. Now, this one just works like that. I don't want any grenades. Just don't... No, I don't want mini games. Why would I want mini games? I want to play the actual game. I haven't bought the game for mini games. I bought the game for the game. Which I guess could include mini game. Now it's confusing me. Okay, that was just for a funny thing. There we go. And splat. Well, not splat, more like a kaboom. A kaboom. Yes, we know, a kaboom. So I need to hit it at the ground. There we go. I hit them both in the head. Not really, but okay. This is just the night version of Bullet City, which makes no sense to me. Oh, I need to hit the. I thought that'd be TNT because it was red. I if it's red, it should be TNT. That's just weird, that would never actually happen. But then this game is completely unrealistic, like Pokemon in general. And you hit the blue one, but where's the red button? And if I hit the red button, that will bolt them into there. It's just simple physics, really. Okay. Even though that is completely unrealistic of bullets. If any of you have watched any sort of gun YouTube channel before, you should know. That's more realistic. Apart from the second bullet bounced way too much. And splat. I suppose I don't have no ads anymore. 
Like, can T does possibly give enough power to kill you for a wall, but not like the way that they're depicting it. The person did a front somersault when I did that. Yep. Now that's just weird. Even dead? Nope. Ah, there they are. Even though it was like a light tap. Stop. Everyone wants to push the big red buttons. I knew that would happen. Otherwise, I wouldn't have given me two bullets. I would have given me three. Oh. Oh. You should always start at the bottom. And work your way up. Because it has a further area to fall. Meaning which it can then build up more speed and explode easier on impact. I just ran over him and that was it. It's much harder than you think. Ah, there we go. I knew it would happen eventually. I knew what to do. It's just hard. It's like I know what is here, but it is kind of hard because. I have to judge it much less easily, and I can't really judge stuff like that. Oh, for this one, it's a swinging pendulum, so I need to hit him once the thing has lifted up off the ground. Okay, I guess that makes more sense. It's possible with one bullet, I know that. Since I've already done two of them with one bullet, dang it. Still a little bit over. There we go. They kind of all hit at the same time. I'm obsessed with shooting people in the head because I know that they will die. Well, unless you look at some people. Drop. I was not expecting to drop it like that. Dang it. I knew that would kill him, but I didn't know if it would kill the other guy. He hit him as low down as possible. There we go. I knew that would work. Okay. The fix doesn't know how to work. Dang it, I wish that could have hit him. Yeah, it was, I like how I always hit them straight through the eye if I hit them in the head. Perfect. Okay, I was not expecting it to be that perfect. Okay, I wasn't expecting that either. I didn't know there was three, I thought there was only one. Go. I could have done it in two, but I didn't. Oh, the locks. There we go. I need to just get everyone on one side. Yeah. Dang it. So close. So close. I actually hit his hat though. That was the surprising part. Anyway, I think I'll wrap things up there for today. So, like and subscribe and all that. And bye.